Hey YouTube and welcome back. So yeah, I'm not around for months and then you get videos every couple of days from me, which is really odd, but this is something that I couldn't not open on camera. This is something that I ordered, to be fair, not that long ago. We've just been waiting for it to be printed and to be posted out and Johnny, who I've bought from, was waiting for the right um, kind of postage material to get it to us, so it arrived in perfect condition. So this is three prints from a um, an artist called Johnny Bush. Um, he's not just an artist, he's an author um, who's wrote some books and hopefully they'll be arriving soon and I can give you a review on how awesome they will be. Um, but I was kind of introduced to Johnny's work through the fan club for Wednesday 13. He is the illustrator and the writer and the inker and the colour and everything else for the Wednesday 13 comics which are available online if you're um, a member of the Patreon group. And amazingly the small world that we live in, um, Johnny currently lives in Kent with his wife and kids but he used to live in Manchester, he's a Manchester lad so he's quite local and I've been to the same many of the same gigs as him, I know the same people that he knows, we may have even hung out in the same circles without really knowing who each other were and because of the amazing joy of the internet and through Zoom um, I've started to know him and his wife really well which is pretty cool. I will stick Johnny's de details and his information down below um, so you can have a look and maybe pick up some of these for yourself. These are a very limited run. I think it's a run of 20 or 25 of these as the first run. Um, but he is hoping to do other images and other artists and things like that. And I'm also, I'm going to give a shout out to his wife as well. Uh, I think it's Becky D Photos or Becky V D Photography. Um, she has ph photographed everybody um, kind of through the rock scene uh, from Wednesday 13 through to Ghost. Um, she's done festivals. She's been um the invited guest to photograph all of them and she is currently running um, some offers on the photographs of the band that she's done and I think she's doing it for like a crazy silly price like maybe a tenner a print or you get a discount if you order multiples on that um, that's at the time of us recording this I think she announced today she's going to do two prints for 15 quid uh, which is pretty cool um, if you're interested I will stick her details down below as well I'll stick her Instagram and her website um, get on there and have a look uh, help these guys out um, I think it's been difficult for artists at this time of year especially during kind of the Covid and stuff and with there being no gigs and they're just the, the, the sweetest nicest people ever but anyway let's get into this a really nice big um, letter um, and Johnny did say something the other day on a, on a, a zoom chat that we were having that there might be something extra in here as well so we'll see I'm trying to be very, very careful. And he said they were going to be well packed. And they're well packed. They really are. There's nothing else. Yes, there is. Which is brilliant. So that is an original. I'm sorry about the language. If you don't like it, uh, one of my favourite films is House of a Thousand Corpses, and that is a Johnny Bush original, Captain Spaulding's. And it does say on the back of it, thank you so much for the continued support. This is what you're asking, how you take home your mama some chicken and I won't have to stick my boot up your ass. All the best, JB. Uh, well, thank you, Johnny. That is amazing. I need to find a place for this as well and there is a small envelope here as well with nothing on it oh and these are the certificates of authenticities oh and that's cool I've got number seven of each one of these prints so let's get in these and see what they actually look like So these are super well wrapped and I'm concerned that I'm going to open them up and make an absolute mess of them. So I now need to find some frames and get these framed up nicely. Oh wow. 
so these are some of the monsters so that's I think he's called this one the cow yeah this is Dracula but the detail is beautiful so as I said these are limited edition oh wow okay these are limited edition of 10 pieces so much smaller limited run than what I originally thought Frankie. So that's the monster. You can't go wrong with classic monsters. But look at the eyes, the eyes just follow you. Johnny, buddy, these are absolutely spectacular. And if you've got the monster, there's only one more to follow suit. And that's the bride. And I found a really weird thing out the other day which blew my mind. But the wig that she wears isn't black. It's actually ginger. Which is, that is mind-boggling, it can't be. But no, they are beautiful. I'm going to have to find pride of place for these. I think these are going to go up the staircase into the loft, into my toy room. And go and place there. I get a smaller one for the Spaldings as well. Um, but yeah, as I said, these are all limited edition. Number seven of each one, which is beautiful. I really like it when you get you get something and they take the time to make sure that each limited number is the same one as well. Um, but yeah, as I said, I will stick all the Johnny's details down there. I'll stick all the Becky's details down there as well. Um, go and check out the amazing work that he's been doing. I've seen some of the other famous faces that he's also done. Um, he's done some amazing paintings of, um, of the guys from Ghost. He's got Marilyn Manson um, painting at the minute, which it's a bit controversial on whether you should release anything with Manson's face on at the minute um, but the likeness and the work behind it is, is amazing and the depth it, I think it's the eyes in these that get me about how kind of how the eyes just follow you but yeah um, thick cardstock um, beautifully done good work Johnny thank you so much buddy um, but yeah, as I said, I'll stick all the details down. Um, thank you for tuning in. Um, I've got some more stuff on the way. I don't know when the next video will try and come out. Um, if I can get two a week and try and get the ball rolling to keep it going, I will do. If you're a long time subscriber, long time watcher, way back in October, I got um, some Lego and I've still not built it. So I need to do some Let's Builds. On those things as well I will give you an update on what we've done kind of in the house um, now that the loft is almost the, the loft the toy room uh, is almost complete um, as I said in a previous video the we had some damage in the winter from the roof um, it was work that was done on another house which has caused damage to our house cheers guys and we've had damp come right the way through kind of right through the whole house i had we had damp in this room that we were unaware of so we've redecorated and resourced all of this room out kind of modernized a lot of things um and just made it more us the roof has been completely taken off and reinstalled which meant that the work that i had done in the loft was destroyed and i had to go again and start from scratch i've spent uh, the last week or two going through every cabinet and every cupboard to kind of dust it and clean it and make sure that everything's sorted and everything's kind of better than what it was and hopefully I'm almost there fingers crossed but life gets in the way of these things um, and this is just a hobby and I enjoy doing it and I enjoy showing you guys what I've been able to pick up and what where you're able to get it from as well and hopefully that's a good thing and hopefully people are still watching and still enjoying um we're what we're three months maybe until halloween starts hitting the stores 
but it doesn't mean that we can't still get stuff from online or Etsy and things like that, um, which is I've, I've ordered some stuff from Etsy. Um, and hopefully that will arrive in the next week or so. Um, as I said, I, things are arriving sporadically. The postal service isn't the greatest ever. I have the best post lady in the world um, and she... She, she she's just awesome um and she takes great care on what we've got so yeah uh, i'm waffling now because i can uh johnny buddy you are superb this is great this is spectacular i love this balding he's brilliant i wasn't expecting that um yeah until next time guys thank you so much um for tuning in um and take care